Magandang araw po sa inyo lahat. Kung kayo po ay nahihirapan sa mathematics, ang channel na ito ay para sa inyo. Ngayong araw po ay papag-usapan natin ang subtraction of integers. Pero bago yan, kung hindi nyo pa po napapanood yung aking mga videos about addition of integers, pwede nyo po yung balikan para naman po may prior knowledge kayo or magamit kayo dito sa subtraction of integers. Okay, so meron po tayong isang rule. Pero meron po akong iaambag po sa inyo. Ito po yung copy, change, change or CCC. Again, copy, change, change. Ito po ay naibahagi po sa akin ng aking isang estudyante years ago na ibinabahagi ko naman po sa aking mga, mga estudyante at syempre sa inyo naman po ngayon. Okay, so pag-usapan po muna natin itong parts, parts of subtraction equation. So we have 6 minus 5 is equal to, to 1. So ano po yung 6? Yung 6 po yung minuend. So we have the operation. Yan. Pwede po natin basahin niya ng minus. Or that's the so-called subtraction. Yung 5 naman po, subtrahend. Of course, we have the equal sign and then the 1, the difference of 6 and 5. Or 6 minus, minus 5. Okay, so this is now the rule in subtracting integers. To subtract integers, change the sign of the subtrahend, then proceed to addition. So dito po sa ating rule, hindi na banggit kung anong gagawin kay minuend. Okay, so what we need to do is to copy, copy the minuend. Okay, next po, I change, change the operation from subtraction to addition. Another change po, change the sign of the subtrahend. Okay, so base po dito sa rule na to, doon po umugat yung copy, change, change. Again, copy the minuend, change, ad, change subtraction to addition, and change the sign of the subtrahend. Punta po tayo sa subtracting of integers. So find the difference. For example, number 1, we have 10 minus 6. So una, doon sa CCC po natin, copy. So, what are we going to copy? The minuend, which is 10. And is equal to 10. Then next, we have change. What are we going to change? It is the subtraction, change to addition. So, we have 10 plus another change. Change the subtrahend. And the subtrahend is 6. So, from positive 6, turn to negative 6. So, what is now 10 plus negative 6? That is now positive, positive 4. Okay? So, pwede nyo po yung balikan doon yung mga videos ko about um, addition of integers. So, meron po tayong three, three ways of adding integers. Okay, therefore, 10 minus 6 is equal to 4. Next, meron po tayong another example. Number 2, 7 minus negative 9. So, una, copy. Copy the minuend, which is 7. Change, change um, subtraction, okay, this, change subtraction to addition, then another change, change negative 9, the subtrahend, to positive 9. So what is 7 plus 9? That is equal to 16. Therefore, 7 minus negative 9 is equal to 16. Okay, tandaan nyo lang po ha, yung copy, change, change. Next, let's have example number 3. So, we have negative 12 minus 8. So, again, copy. Copy the minuend, which is negative 12. Then, change. Change the operation from subtraction to addition. Next, another change. Change the subtrahend. So, what's the subtrahend? We have positive 8 turn to negative 8. So, change the sign of the subtrahend. Now, we have negative 12 plus negative 8. So, I want you to look at the signs of the addends. So, we have negative 12 and negative 8. So, they are both negative, negative integers. Now, how are we going to add these numbers? Okay. So, you just need to add their absolute value. So, the absolute value of negative 12 is positive 12 and the absolute value of negative 8 is positive 8. So, 12 plus 8 is 20. 
So, what's the common sign? The common sign is negative. That's why negative 12 plus negative 8 is equal to negative 20. Therefore, negative 12 minus 8 is equal to negative 20. Next. Okay, number 4. Negative 20 minus negative 36. So, copy negative 20. Change subtraction to addition. Next, change negative 36. So change the sign of negative 36, and that is positive 36. Next, negative 20 plus 36 is equal to positive 16. Now the question is, how did we arrive with this answer? So Negative 20, the sign is negative, and then 36 is positive, unlike sign, so you need to subtract their absolute values. So you will be having 36 minus 20, and that is 16. What is the sign of the, of the number with the greater absolute value? And that is positive. That's why this is positive 16. Therefore, negative 20 minus 36 is equal to 16. Ayan, tandaan po natin, copy, change, change for the subtraction of integers. Meron po kayong natutuhan sa channel na ito, pakiclick lang po ang mga icons na ito, like, subscribe, at yung notification bell para updated po kayo sa ating mga post tungkol sa mathematics. Thank you for watching!